Hi guys, what's up? This is Brittany Joshua Bines, and I am from section 3A A1. And for today, I am back at it again with another tutorial video on how to 3D model using AutoCAD 3D. Um, so our instructor is architect Maricel C. Vigor. Yeah, and our activity, our midterm activity is about the turning torso um, by one of the most famous architects in the world, architect Santiago Calatrava. By the way, he's not just an architect, but he's also a structural engineer. So the turning torso is located in Sweden. And if you plan to watch that building though, you just go to Sweden. If you don't have money then, you create your own, I guess. <laughs> ano ba ba yun natin, no? We are going to start the tutorial video in 3, 2, 1. Things first, I inserted the reference picture. And then, I just copy the body or trace the body. Since it's symmetrical, so I just trace it in half and then I'm just going to mirror it later though. Since I just copied everything. I extruded the body, command extrude, then extrude the middle and use the command sub truck to form a hollow circle in the middle of the body. And then I use extrude to all the remaining um, parts. So this one is I exploded it and then use command extrude again to connect it to the other body, to the other parts of the body. And then just like this one, I just use command extrude just to you know connect them. Now they are connected. And then in the middle, going to explode it first, and then we are going to extrude. And now they are already connected. Now I'm going to group group it and then I'm going to rotate it so rotate then we are going to trace it to form a pathway because we are going to array it later on. So we are going to use the command array, use the polar and then locate the center. change the value to 10 and then the field to 91 and here we go then we're going to select it and then we are going to move it away from the reference picture we're going to explode it and then we are going to move it upward move it with an interval of 10 10 meters so and there you go you already have the you know the height of the model and then the next is we're going to connect it by using the tool spline spline line after doing the connecting lines we are going to Use the command sweep to make the connecting lines a solid line or a 3D line. Then let's draw a circle in the middle of the body and use extrude command to 
connect all of the body and there you go now I'm going to assign the colors according to the reference picture so it's going to be a yellow for the body yeah it's now the same now I'm going to copy it and we are going to make the same way as the turning torso um we're just going to use the love command love all the bodies and then there you go you already have your own um turning torso model 3d model from AutoCAD. this one is from the reference picture it's the same from the reference picture and then this one is the same as the turning torso so I just use command loft for this one. This is really interesting, you know. I hope you learned something from my tutorial video for another episode of tutorial video for today.